Today we're reviewing the extremely popular Samsung Meteorite mic. Like its older sibling, the Meteor mic, the Meteorite is a USB condenser microphone that's available in three different colors, chrome, which I have here today, white and black. I'll leave links to all three colors below. The Meteorite is a very simple yet very unique USB microphone. The device has two parts, the magnetic base and the microphone body itself. The mic's body locks smoothly onto the concave magnetic surface on the base. This allows the mic to tilt smoothly to almost any recording position depending on where the mic is placed and where your sound source is located. And all this is possible because of this notch on the back of the base that allows enough clearance for its USB cable while the body is tilted all the way up and even side to side. The body is again very simple with a grill and an LED on the front. The LED stays blue when the mic is plugged in and blinks red to warn you when you're peaking. The USB cable is permanently attached to the body and is three feet long. This will be more than enough for use with most laptops and desktops. And if you do need more cable, you can always use a USB extender and I'll leave a link to one below. The microphone is pretty much plug and play. Plug it into a USB port on any Mac or PC and the computer instantly recognizes it and it's ready to use. There are no drivers or software to install. It's truly plug and play. Now you can also connect it to an iPad or iPhone using the camera connector and I'll leave a link to that connector below. Now I wanted to test the Meteorite exactly the way most people would use it. So I have it hooked up to my laptop and it's about two feet away from me. Now the Meteorite has a cardioid pickup pattern. So make sure to tilt the mic to face your mouth or audio source. I'm using the Audacity recording software to record. I've selected the Meteorite as my recording device and I've set the input gain manually to ensure I'm not peaking. So the audio you're hearing right now is from the Samsung Meteorite right mic and I'm recording in a relatively quiet room. I'm going to read you a quote so you can hear how it sounds. To such an extent does nature delight and abound in variety that among her trees there is not one plant to be found which is exactly like another. And not only among the plants but among the boughs, the leaves and the fruits you will not find one which is exactly similar to another. And that's a quote from Leonardo da Vinci. As you can probably tell the quality is really good. It's a huge improvement over the built-in mic on most laptops and I'd even say it's slightly better than the Samsung Go mic which we tested a few years ago. However the Go mic does have two advantages. The Go mic has a headphone jack to monitor the mic live and a variety of options to mount the microphone including the option to mount it to a mic stand. When it comes to audio quality though I'd have to give a slight advantage to the Meteorite. Feel free to also check out our review of the Samsung Go mic. So is the Meteorite worth the money? I think for about $40 it's worth every penny. It's simple to use, well designed, hassle free and produces really good audio quality. This is a mic designed for folks who want to improve the audio quality of their videos or podcasts but don't need a complicated microphone. It's a hassle free device that produces really good audio quality. However, if you do need live audio monitoring and the ability to mount the microphone microphone to a mic stand, I'd recommend spending a little extra and going for the Samsung Meteor mic. I'll leave a link to that below. Now if you own either one of these, tell us about your experience in the comments below. Hope this video has been useful. If it has, please hit that like button and subscribe for more reviews. Thanks for watching and see you next time.